decided to sing lift up your voice we decided to sing singing hallelujah hallelujah hello anybody there is it thing on guys yeah it's on okay huh? hi guys how you doing hey how you doing how you doing guys it's been a good year yeah and so just to let you guys know man you guys had a pretty interesting week yeah i did you know, yeah, like a lot, a lot of things going on. Yeah, like what? What did you guys have going on? Well, we had a big fight. A what? We had a big fight. A big fight? Yeah. You know, I was, I came in one day and she was you not know, cleaning her room, and so I asked her if she could clean her room, and it was not clean. Yeah. But you know what happened? What happened? Well, she. You know, learn to honor me and learn to clean our room. Yeah, I did. You did? Yeah, I did. I clean our, our room. You clean my room? Yeah, I clean our room. It's awesome. Well, it's awesome. You clean up room. So, wait, you guys had a fight. Mm hmm. And, you know, you learned to, you know, first you didn't honor him, but then you later on, you learned to, dis, you learned to honor him? Yeah, I learned to honor him. You know, so this weekend, guys, like Grandpa Paul, you know, had a pretty interesting, you know, argument with his granddaughter. And so it was a moment where she didn't, she didn't honor him. She disrespected him. But then later on, there was a moment where, you know, she did honor him. And so you guys want to know, like, honor is very important. You're honoring your father, honor your mother, honor your parents. In fact, this is in the book of Ephesians, to honor your mother or father. If you do, you have a long life. And so I want you guys to see this clip about, you know, a moment when, you know, she dishonored, you know, Grandpa Paul. And as well when Grandpa Paul saw that where she did honor him. And you know, so one thing I want to know, you guys to know is that when you do honor somebody, there's a blessing that comes in within that. There's a reward that comes with that. So check out this video and you guys will enjoy it, right? Yeah. Enjoy it. Kelly, what on earth? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kelly? Kelly? Huh? Oh, hi, Grandpa. What are you doing? This is a mess. You got you got work to do. Huh? I don't have a job. No, I mean homework. Oh. I don't like school. School is boring. I don't, I, I hate that. I want to play. Kelly, now listen. You got to do your homework. But turn that music off. No, I don't want to turn my music off. You can't do it. Excuse me, Kelly. No, no. Uh, uh. There, turn it off. No! Why turn my music? Because you gotta listen. You gotta uh, listen to me. No! Kelly, listen. You live in our house. You got to listen to our rules. You have to honor us. <sighs> honor? Forget about that. You have to obey us. Even though you live here under a household, now I'm not your parent, but still, you have to honor us. I don't want to listen to you. I'm tired of this. Forget this. I'm going. I'm going to play outside or go home. <laughs> Kelly, scare with me, Grandpa. Come here. Forget this. Kelly, Kelly, come here. Kelly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kelly. Oh, hi, Grandpa. Hold on. Let me turn off my music. Hi. Hi. How can I help you? Kelly, what are you doing? Um, playing? You got a lot of homework here. Did you do your homework? No, I got distracted. I'm sorry. Can you please do your homework? Yeah. After you clean your from us, okay? All right. Sorry, Grandpa. Um, yeah. How about this? How about you don't worry about dinner? I'll cook dinner for you, too. Oh, really? Yeah, and I'll throw out the trash. Throw out the trash? Hallelujah. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. Also... I already put away the dishes and did the dishes today. You do the dishes? Thank you so much, Kelly. Yeah, sorry, Grandpa. I just want a little break. Yeah, you deserve a little break, but please get back to your homework after you clean up. Okay, thank you. Love you. Love you, Grandpa. He's just a great guy. Well, time to put away and get on back to homework. Oh, boy. Wow, that was a great video. I'm so glad, Liz, you learned how to really honor Grandpa Paul. And, you know, showing that, you know, in the midst of hard times and good times, even though he's not your dad, that you learn to 
respect and honor your elders, especially your grandpa. And so would you say that you've learned to honor your teachers and as well as your parents, as well as your family and friends? Yeah. Also, I learned to honor those I don't like. You don't like? Yeah. Like this guy named, you know, this guy named Billy. He makes fun of me, guys. And so one day at class, you know, he always made fun of me because I'm a blonde. And he says, blondes are so silly and dumb. And that really hurt my feelings. But, you know, the Bible says to love those that don't like you. And so, even though it wasn't easy, I learned to show kindness and honor him. And so one day, it was his birthday. And nobody wanted to give him a gift. But you know what? I gave him a gift. And he loved it. In fact, it was chocolate. His favorite. And then from that day forward, he learned to respect me and honor me. And no longer made fun of me. In fact, we became friends. And we played in the playground. So I learned to honor those, even though they don't like me. Wow, that's awesome, dude. That how you really honor him. In fact, it reminds me of a story where back in the day while I was in elementary school, this guy named Nolan Quick was a guy that I made fun of because he was fat, he was silly, we got in fights, he made fun of me, and we were getting fist fight, and you know, we would argue with each other, and we were both in special ed, so we would both call each other stupid, and you know what happened? You know, one day the teacher set us aside and said, if you guys don't get your act straight, you guys are going to be sent home. And so we learned to put our size, our, our differences aside, and rather than hearing the punishment of our mom and dad, we decide to make amends and make peace. And so we actually became really good friends, in fact, best friends. And so this guy, you know, who made fun of me, who, you know, really, you know, made fun of me, who really picked at me, you know, didn't like me, I learned to honor and understand him because he had a lot of big struggles in his life, as well as I did. And when I learned to understand his hurt, and he understood my hurt, we began to understand that we can help each other in our friendship. So Noel and I became best friends to this day, we're best friends. And also, you know, he's a man of God, I'm a man of God. And so I think, you know, the love of Christ really came in our life both and changed us. But you know what? I just say this, when you have somebody that doesn't like you and you learn to honor them, love them, and show them kindness, there's a lot of great rewards that, in, that can happen. They can like, you know, like hear what she said, you know, how they could come your friend or like Noel and how he could become my friend. So guys, Learn to honor those that don't like you, pray for those who make fun of you, and learn to bless those who don't like you. Because, you know, in the end of the day, it's loving those that, you know, that God says love your enemy and pray for those who persecute against you. But Jesus said to love your neighbor as you love yourself. And so one way you can love your neighbor as you love yourself is by showing kindness. So this week I give you a challenge. If you know somebody's picking on you in class, or somebody's picking you on your cousins, your family members, you know, show them an act of kindness. Give them a treat, you know, give them a high five, give them more encouragement, give them a gift, and see what happens. <clears throat> yeah, give it a try. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, give us a like, subscribe, hit that bell notification for all future videos. For we, won't, we don't want you to miss a beat. And also, if you love what we're doing here, that we're reaching our youth, we're reaching our children here, here in the city of Newark, California. So, please subscribe, and please, if you love to give, you can click on this link below and give to our ministry. Thank you. Have a grateful day, and God bless. Take care. Bye-bye.